Today we'll be speaking to Arav, who's in his third year at St. John's Medical College. So Arav, to start off, could you tell us the courses you've taken up to the third year and what you've got interested in while doing these courses? Yes, thank you, Sean. Um, so I'm currently pursuing my bachelor's degree in physiotherapy. I'm currently in my third year and uh, the subjects which we have been doing ever since the first year is um, typically the medical subjects, anatomy, physiology, biochemistry and two of our own department subjects which is biomechanics as well as a bit of psychology and sociology. That was in the first year. Then in the second year we had a combination of pathology, microbiology and exercise and electrotherapy which are the department subjects which talk more about the modalities which we use to treat patients such as ultrasound, uh, ultraviolet radiation, moist heat and stuff like that in detail which we learn in the second year the mechanism and the physiology behind that and now right now I'm in the third year and what I'm studying is general medicine, surgery and orthopedics in brief and my two core subjects for this year are cardiorespiratory physiotherapy and musculoskeletal and sports physiotherapy and in the fourth year when I go uh, I'll be studying more about the neurological subjects like neurophysiotherapy, neurosurgery and community based uh, rehabilitation and community medicine so these are the courses which they offer for our course of physiotherapy. So you also talked about entering fourth year and also pursuing a short internship yeah. and then graduating. Could you tell us and give us a brief about that internship and yeah. what you'd be doing? Um, so after we finish our four years, we have a compulsory internship period of six months uh, where we'll be working in our own hospital, the St. John's Medical Hospital uh, and we'll be treating patients in our department. So that uh, internship lasts for six months. It's compulsory for all students in our course uh, of BPT. And uh, we'll get a lot of clinical exposure to patients as well as um, we'll get to work closely with doctors and help in the rehabilitation process of patients later on uh, after they've undergone a surgery or an injury or many other conditions which uh, we'll be learning about in this year and the next year. So, so that is the internship program. Uh, Perfect. So you also talked about uh, taking certain courses and also getting experiential learning through patient visits and stuff like that. Can you tell us more about how that's helped you? Uh, yeah, so every year we have one uh, rural outing program which is close by. We have a college for uh, outreach programs as well where we go and we, um, we serve the people over there who are um, uh, who need to be treated and stuff so there's a rural hospital close by uh, in Bangalore it's in Muglur so we go there once or twice every year and we treat patients over there could you tell us more about the admission process and what tips would you give the students applying yeah so as of 2024 the admission criteria for physiotherapy in St. John's, in John's Medical College is as follows um, they will shortlist 100 candidates for an interview as well as an entrance exam which will be held at the centre in the college itself and another criteria is that you will have to secure 45% marks in your 12th grade science stream which is of physics, chemistry and biology. Other than that, um, 40 students will be uh, selected for the course out of 100 candidates which are shortlisted. And potentially in the future, they are planning to uh, uh, add NEET as a criteria for admissions, but that is not certain yet. And as of this year, it's only the criteria which I mentioned earlier. So NEET is not a criteria as of now for admissions into physiotherapy. Check the dates, do check the website for when the admission uh, document comes out. And uh, you will have to register yourself for the interview as well as the entrance exam.